there, and welcome to the exciting world of hip. Good morning. I'm Andrea Jackson with your wake-up call for Wednesday, January 26, 2011. Here is a preview of some of the stories making headlines. President Obama is calling in Mr. Freeze. He is trying to curb spending for five years to take the heat off of the ginormous cost of his health care plan. Rahm Emanuel back on the ballot to run for mayor in Chicago while courts figure out whether or not he was legitimately a hometown boy for the last year while working in D.C. as President Obama's chief of staff. A law firm in need of publicity is suing Taco Bell, claiming there's no real beef in their ground beef. Mickey D's might raise prices to keep up with the cost of food, and threats are keeping lion tacos off the menu at an Arizona taco and tequila joint. No cheerleaders on the sidelines for Super Bowl 45. The Packers and Steelers are two of six teams without cheer squads. It's a cheerocracy. Uh, the award for the dirtiest hotel in America goes to the Grand Resort Hotel in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. The not-so-grand tribute compliments of TripAdvisor. The Jersey Shore is headed for the homeland. Season 4 will take place in Italy. And to think they still have that trash problem in Naples. And the King's Speech scored a dozen Oscar nominations. Even True Grit proved Oscar-worthy with 10 nods. The Hollywood Red Carpet Showdown airs Sunday, February 27th. Your New York weather forecast, rain and snow, highs in the 30s. That is your Wednesday morning wake-up call. I'm Andrea Jackson, and I'll ring you in the morning. Be good.